Earth's 4.6 billion year history is mind-bogglingly vast. Deep time and enormous distances have defined our planet. I'd like to share with you some geological tools that you can use to see our world in a whole new light. Welcome, Welcome to, to Project, Project Perspective. Perspective. Today I'm going to delve into the deepest of time. But before we do, I'd like to think about the old things in your life and what you would define as being old. I, of course, consulted Google. These were some of the images that came up. One of those dial-up phones, the trusty SCM Smith Corona typewriter, a cast iron iron, still the only way I can get music into my car, a rusty old steam train, whatever this is, and whoever that is, now you may think those things are old. But we're going to be talking about something a lot older, the age of the Earth. 4.6 billion years old. Now this is a huge number, something that is a little bit abstract, a concept that might be difficult to grapple with. Scientists and educators make use of analogues to relate the known to the intangible. This is where, wait for it, comes in. For two simple reasons. I found this picture of him with his arms outstretched, and his wingspan is exactly 184 centimeters. We are going to use Jason's wingspan to represent all of Earth's 4.6 billion years of existence, with planetary accretion, the time when the planet formed on one fingertip, all the way up to the other fingertip, the present day. The reason the 184 centimeter wingspan is important here is because 4.6 billion divided by 184 is exactly 25 million. Therefore, one centimeter of Jason's wingspan equates to 25 million years of Earth's history. That means one millimeter equates to 2.5 million years and 0.1 of a millimeter is 250,000 years. Knowing this, we can start to add all of Earth's history along Jason Derulo's wingspan. He is our analog, sitting at the elbow joint over a billion years after the formation of the planet, life began. We find evidence in the fossil record of very, very simple single-celled organisms called prokaryotes at about the location of Derulo's left pectoral muscle. Around two billion years ago, life started to become a little bit more complicated. Eukaryotic cells developed. You may be thinking at this point, the story looks like it's almost over, sitting just at his wrist, and almost nothing has happened. But this is where Earth's history really gets exciting. The Cambrian explosion. The fossil record is teeming with life at this point. But all we've got left is Jason's hand. So let's zoom in and delve deeper. At about Jason's wrist marks the Cambrian explosion, where life took off inside of our oceans. Little critters started to emerge. Life within the Cambrian oceans diversified, but the dry land remained barren until 470 million years ago when the earliest plants made their way out of the oceans and colonized the terrestrial environment. Not long after, animals followed, crawling out of the primitive seas. Now on land and in the sea, life diversified further until around 234 million years, our favorite animals, the dinosaurs evolved. On the Jason Derulo geological timescale, this occurs at the base of his fingers. And these dinosaurs, they survived for quite a number of years until 66 million years ago, an enormous meteorite smashed into the Gulf of Mexico, killing our beloved dinosaurs, sparking a new era. Without the major threat of the dinosaurs, mammals were able to really take hold. Until just under two millimeters from the very end of Jason Derulo's fingertips, Australopithecus arrived, one of our really early ancestors. And as you can see, we're really, really running out of space here, and we haven't even got to us, humans. We didn't even come into existence until just 200,000 years ago. On our Jason Derulo geological time scale, this is under 0.1 of a millimeter. To put that in perspective, this is about the diameter of a human hair. This diameter of a hair represents all Homo sapien history. This means 
if we got a nail file and gave Jason Derulo a manicure. One gentle stroke of the nail file, it would wipe away every skerrick of our entire history. Gone.